What's up everybody? Welcome back to the homestead. Thank you for watching this video. Today we have a fun project planned, but first I wanted to tell you guys in case you missed it in one of the last videos, we have a meet and greet coming up this Saturday, June 10th. Blonde moment, you guys. July 10th. The date is July 10th, not June 10th. Travers Park, Sandpoint, Idaho. Um, there's going to be free food and like drinks for subscribers. So if you're in the North Idaho area, We'd love to meet you mm -hmm. and a bunch of other YouTubers in the area. So yeah. it should be pretty fun. Yeah, please come and join us. But like Liz said, we have a cool project going on. We're going to be making some coasters today. As a lot of you guys know, we just launched a website not too long ago, only about two weeks ago, I think. So mm -hmm. link in the description, check out the website. We're going to be making coasters to sell on that website as a way mm -hmm. to try to like keep this homestead sustainable and try to make it work for itself. Mm -hmm. We got a link to the previous video when we fell the tree for these coasters right off of the property here. So today we are going to try to sand them down and make them look pretty nice, put a finish on them and uh, see yeah. where it goes. Cool, let's yeah. do it. So at the meet and greet guys, I know for sure there's going to be a few of the local channels around here. There's some pretty sweet channels that are going to be there. So you guys should definitely check these channels out. I know Martin Johnson Off Grid Living will be there. I think Makers Movement is going to be there. Um, I think Cause We Can Farms is going to be there. Who else? I'm trying to think off the top of my head here. Tony and Stewart with Breaking Free Off Grid. Um, Jeremy, yep, Living the Dream Off Grid will be there. There's going to be a lot of channels there, so you guys should definitely try to make it up if you're in the area. If not, there's always next year. We got the finish, what is it? It's like a polyurethane finish on the uh, wood cookie coasters. Yep, the yeah. coasters. That worked out pretty good. So we figured like we're just scheming, you know, scheming ways to make this place work for itself. Mm -hmm. And Liz came up with a sweet idea. Instead of, or I guess in addition to just the little cookies, we're gonna, you know, cut some bigger ones and do some plant handles. Yeah, so you know, like so some... Full big, size rounds almost. Yeah, Close big wood it. disc. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, I don't know, 12 inch. Yeah, so thing. we're, we're yeah. going to walk down to the sawmill right now, get that all set up, and slice some, some more birch up. Yeah, see how it goes. See if we can do this. What are you doing, Jill? What are you doing?
It's hot. Yes. Very oh. hot. Well, that worked out really well. So these things are pretty cool looking. We do need to sand them. So we're going to take them back up to the house, get some sand on them, see how they look. Yep. Yep. Let's do it. Okay. It's not that far, but it feels like a long trek to the house when it's hot out. Ah. <laughs> you got those, big guy? I'm going to work out in two. Like in the chain. <laughs> So little midgen. These things have like some crazy designs in them. You know, it probably started to be rot and we caught it at like just the right time. This thing, there's no, you know, it doesn't seem real soft. So we'll see if we can sand these things up. Quick test, these are much too wet to be sanding right now. It's just like turning it into like nastiness. So these need to dry. Luckily the coaster sanded up nice and fine. So those are good and dry. Um, luckily we kind of cut that a little bit close, but got yeah, it. those are good and dry. They're primo. So yeah, cool. um, that's a wrap then. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we hope to see you guys at the meet and greet, mm -hmm. July 10th. Details on our website. Appreciate you guys watching this video. We'll see you in the next one. Yep, thank you. Bye.